That's right. Yeah, Yvette Harrell sent Kamala Harris a letter and aside from asking her to go down to the U.S. Mexico border, she also asked to be part of that Guatemala Mexico trip. The recent crisis at the U.S.-Mexico border gaining national attention because of the influx of immigrants fleeing their home country. To get to the root of the problem, Vice President Kamala Harris is making her first international trip to Mexico and Guatemala. It's going to be an, an honest and, and real conversation, so I do. I'm, I'm there to listen as much as I am to share um, perspective. But it's not sitting well with Republican Representative Yvette Harrell. You know, it sounds great. She's going to go to a foreign country, talk to their government, talk about these issues. But until we really have a conversation that can actually address this, I, I don't see how she does it without understanding the complexity and the sheer size of this issue. Harold says she sent the vice president a letter addressing how the crisis at the border is affecting those in southern New Mexico. She also asked to go with Harris on her trip. She says in order to have bipartisan conversations. But I believe taking somebody who has the experience and represents a state that borders uh, Mexico would have been a great idea. And to date, we have not heard back from her office or the administration. While Harrell is disappointed with the lack of presence at the southern border, Democrats, including Senator Ben Ray Lujan, are applauding the vice president, saying it is essential to continue pressing government and civil society leaders in the region to strengthen compliance with labor, humanitarian and international human rights laws. Senator Martin Heinrich also sent a statement of support saying, quote, I thank Vice President Harris for strengthening America's presence on the world stage and stand ready to rebuild our immigration system. Harrell also says she hopes that the vice president is able to come back to the U.S. with some type of resolution. Live in Albuquerque, Stephanie Muniz, KOAT Action 7 News. Steph, thank you. The vice president, Kamala Harris, is set to travel to Mexico tomorrow.